What's up guys, welcome back. Um, today I have my second OC Celebrity box. Yesterday I opened up the Christmas OC Celebrity box and this is the Grail box number five. This is a $500 box. There should be 11 autographs in it. Um, there should be six pieces in here. I think one of them is a KSI piece and I think there should be like a prop and Funko Pop? I don't know how many Funko Pops are. Honestly, I don't know anything about this box other than it's a grail box. I don't know who's going to be in it. I think uh, OC Celebrity Marketing on their Whatnot page the week after they sold this box, they actually sold six more boxes. I think it was six. <clears throat> they said they had 66 available. They put 60 on the website and then six on whatnot that they opened up live I missed that stream um, I don't think I wanted to see it anyway I, I, I don't want to see what's in this box I don't know if there's any chances for chase items I don't know if everyone got the same exact thing I know if everyone got the same autographs I don't know if everyone got the same exact things but all right so this is our OC celebrity sticker top everything is covered <clears throat> So we got just the paper, nothing in there. So I see three white boxes, so we must have three Funko Pops. So I'm gonna put these to the side and do that last. We got our Twizzlers. And then we got this. Box is empty. So we'll put the Funko Pops here that list. I don't know how many things are in here. This looks like this is upside down. So let's see. Because I don't want to see everything. I'm just going to cut the tape. I'll just cut it on one side. I'll flip it up like this so I don't see everything. So I'll just take the top one off. This looks like an 11 by 17. I hope I don't do the big thing first. But... Oh, what is this? Oh, Pee-wee's Big Adventure. Your pal Pee-wee Herman. Well, wow, this is really cool. Oh, we got Danny Elfman here. Lynn Stewart, the nun. Mark Holton? Francis? This looks like... Is that E.G. Daly? I think that's the, the woman that does the voice for, um, like, Tommy Pickles and stuff on the Road Rats. I think. I don't really know a lot about Pee-wee's Big Adventure, so, I mean, I'm not exactly sure who all these signatures are, but this is a big... This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think, if I'm looking at it right. One, two, this is Francis. One, two... Three, four. Oh no, this is Paul Rubens. This just says your pal Pee Wee Herman, so that must be his inscription. So it looks like one, two, three, four, five, six signatures on this. That's pretty cool. It looks really nice. <clears throat> wow. I think that was the big piece of the box that we got first. <laughs> But well, let's just keep going. I like that. So far, so good. Ready? Got some of these are upside down. Oh my goodness. That's Super Mario Brothers, the movie. I actually liked this movie when I was a kid. I know. It's probably not a very popular movie. But this is Bob Hoskins and John Leguizamo in the picture. Since Bob Hoskins passed away, I'm going to assume that that's a John Leguizamo signature. I don't have his signature, so that's a cool one. Yes, I'm pretty sure it is. I'm going to look all these up at the end. I'm just going to keep going. All right, this looks like there's some kind of prop in here. This looks like a license plate. Let's see what it says. Oh, that's awesome. This is Bob Odenkirk. 
this says lawyer up. So that's a Bob Odenkirk autograph from uh, Better Call Saul, which is one of my favorite shows. One of my favorite shows. <clears throat> Obviously, my number one favorite show is Breaking Bad. So <laughs> this is really cool. I was not expecting that. A Bob Odenkirk autograph. This is a Beckett Witnessed. Beckett Witnessed. These other two are OC Celebrity Authenticated. So, all right, so that's one, two, three things. And we got our cast piece already. So these next three are gonna be um, single autograph Funko Pops. Because we got all that six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So they're all gonna be one autograph. Because we got six on that one, so. All right, let's keep it going. So far, this is this is a pretty good box. I mean, it's a lot of money, but I mean, for what you're getting in it, I can't get this box open. Ugh. All right, let's see. I'm gonna not peek. One, two, oh wait, there's Beckett Field Bubble Wrap there. You're not gonna be able to see what it is. Can't tell what this is. I, can't, I don't know, it looks almost like a Dracula or something from the back. Or, Maybe it's some kind of anime. I don't know. How the hell you open this? Come on. There we go. Emperor Palpatine. Who's that signature? I don't know anything about Well this says this shows the pictures that the that the I knew it. This is Tim Curry. Is Tim Curry El Emperor Palpatine? That's his logo on the side and the OC celebrity authentication there. I'll be honest, I'm a huge horror fan and if we were going to get a Tim Curry in this box I was really hoping it was going to be a Pennywise but this is pretty cool I, I had no idea maybe it's like in the animated series or something like that but it shows in this line because this is pop number 433 431 is Ben Solo and then there's Ray Emperor Palpatine Ray so I don't know why. I wonder if he's like Emperor Palpatine in the new one. I didn't even finish the new three. I like Star Wars. I'm not a Star Wars nerd. Like I'm, I'm a nerd about other things. But as far as Star Wars goes, I don't know a lot. You know, I watched the original three. I loved them when I was a kid. The new. The, the, the prequel ones, I was like, meh. The new ones, I, I watched The Force Awakens. I thought it was really good. The second one, I didn't really care for. And then I just never watched the third one. So, I don't know. Maybe he's involved with this somehow. I'll have to look that up. But that's cool. I like a Tim Curry signature, for sure. And maybe I'll put this on Facebook in some of those groups. I know um, I'm in the 6 uh, 9 Collectibles with um, Half Geek, that's like his, Half Geek from YouTube, he's like, a, he has a, um, a Facebook group on Facebook where you can go and like sell your things, trade your things, so maybe I'll put that up for trade if someone wants that, they could trade me like a Pennywise Tim Curry or something like that. <clears throat> oh... After all I just said about not being a huge Star Wars nerd, we got another Star Wars pop. <clears throat> this is from Obi-Wan Kenobi. Beware the dark side. This is OC authentication also. This is 13 out of 56. This is Darth Vader. Beware the dark side. It says there's a there's a, a little 
looks like an F or something, and then it says Vader. I don't know what that signature is. But then on the side with the authentication, with the sticker, I don't know if you could see in red, it says 13 out of 56. So this must have been like some kind of limited, they only got a certain amount of signatures from this guy on these pops. But this is a, I gotta look these up. I'm gonna look up everything up at the end. So if you bear with me, or if you just wanna skim through cause you hate when I talk and just go all the way to the end, I'll tell everyone what everything is. <laughs> okay, so last pop. I don't think it's a Star Wars pop. I don't know. Can't exactly tell what it is. Come on. <sighs> Holy shit. That's Chuck Norris. Whoa. That's really cool. You know, I was on OC Celebrities, like, their whatnot page, and they were selling one of these on one of their auctions, and I tried to get it, but it, I th people were bidding like crazy on it, and I was like, ah, I don't really want to spend the money on it, but it's in my box now. This and all this other stuff, this is a crazy, crazy box, I gotta say. Um, Tim Curry, you kind of figure that they're going to have in their boxes because they always have Tim Curry. They do, like, exclusive. He does, like, signings exclusively with them. So I was kind of hoping there was going to be a Tim Curry because I, I have, this is only, like, my second box I've ever gotten from them. And they didn't do Tim Curry in the last box that I got. So I was happy about that. Maybe I could trade it for a Pennywise. Um, all right, so this... Obviously, this is Chuck Norris. I don't think we need to look this up. This is Beckett Authenticated. This is so cool. This is so cool. I didn't even know he did, like, signings like that. Honestly, I didn't even know he had a Funko Pop. This <laughs> is really cool. Let's see. I guess, if, I mean, if he has this one, I'm sure he's got more. But we should get a better look at that thing. That is so cool. I mean, who doesn't love Chuck Norris? That's a keeper, I gotta say. I'm keeping that one. Okay, so I looked this one up. This is a cool pop. <clears throat> Let's see, this is from 2022. Actually, I'm curious, this is, what is this Chuck Norris one? Oh, this is from 2018, this Chuck Norris one. I'm like obsessed with that Chuck Norris <laughs> Funko Pop. All right, so this is Beware the Dark Side. This is signed by Tom O'Connell. I looked him up. He is the guy who plays... He's like in the suit for Darth Vader. He does like the stunts and stuff like that. Um, this is 13 out of 56. And... This is, this is actually the Darth Vader from the Obi-Wan Kenobi show. This is like from that line. So this is a cool one too. I mean, it's it's got an inscription, it's got a character name on it. It's limited. It's run out of fifty six. So I mean, that's a that's a you know value there. You know, I don't know if I'm gonna hang on to these Star Wars pops. So I mean, if you see anything you like, you want to message me, or you can check out my eBay store on on the bottom, or like I said, those those groups on Facebook. So. I mean, it's got the Tim Curry hologram on the side, so I, mean, I don't think we really need to look up who it is. I could tell when I was looking at the... I looked at the signature, I'm like, that looks like a Tim Curry signature, but why... Why is that on a Star Wars pop? Okay, so this is why I don't know. He is... Chancellor Pal Palpatine, or Emperor Palpatine, in Star Wars The Clone Wars. I know there's probably people shouting at the screen right now, like, of course, uh, but I don't know, I never watched that show. I know it's a very popular show, and people love that, and now they have, like, the, the Bad Batch or something like that, that's probably popular too. I don't know anything about it, but I had no clue 
that Tim Curry was in this. So I'm sure there's going to be people who are like, oh my God, I want that Funko Pop. So well, I'll trade it for you if you got Tim Curry somewhere else. Something to do with Pennywise. Okay, this one I was right. This is John Leguizamo. That's OC Celebrity sticker on there. This one I was also right, obviously. This is Bob Odenkirk. This is Beckett Witnessed, June 29th, 2022. Last but not least, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. I looked this up on OC Celebrity. This is signed by Paul Rubens, Danny Elfman, Mark Holton, E.G. Daly, uh, Lynn Stewart, and Diane Salinger. That's a big one, man. Rubens inscription reads, your pal Pee Wee Herman. Holton's inscription reads Francis with an exclamation. I guess they're quotes. Well, that's a quote, and so is okay. Daly's inscription reads Dotty, so that's a character name, I'm assuming. And Lynn Stewart's inscription reads Nun X O X. And Salinger's inscription reads Simone. So they all it's. Six people signed it, six people inscribed it, like that's a big deal. And they're not small names either. Paul Rubens, Danny Elfman, E.G. Daly, I'm pretty sure Mark Holton is, I know him from something. That name sounds so familiar. I'm big into horror movies, and I'm pretty sure he's in something that I know. Oh, he's in Leprechaun. Is that what I was thinking of though? I don't think so. I don't know, maybe someone has a name similar to his that I'm thinking of, but maybe I know him from Leprechaun. But this is the big hit of the box. I don't know what everything is exactly worth. I don't know if everyone got exactly the same thing. If you guys got this box and your stuff is not the same as mine, let me know. Because I'm kind of curious, like, did I get a big one or was everyone's this big? But that's really everything I got for this video. I'm very happy with that box. I definitely got way over $500 worth of value, for sure. And if I don't really want all of this stuff, I'm sure I won't have a hard time trading it or reselling it. It's just the value's there. And I know people love this stuff. So that's the video. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you wanna see more videos like this, hit subscribe. You can put on the notification bell if you wanna see every time I upload a video. Um, that's really it. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna do another video right now, and I'm gonna load it tomorrow. I have the Seven Bucks a Pop Last Chance Signature Series box. There's two Funko Pops in there with Signature Series on it. So, if you like this video, come back tomorrow. I'll open up that box. You can check it out. Thanks.